What's up everybody? Welcome back to an all new episode of Conflicts. Today we'll be looking at a brand new product. This here is the Akaso Ultra Lightweight 40K Vlog Camera. Alright, so uh, it's a very interesting concept. It's a very tiny sized keychain camera that has a built in 4K camera that is one of the very first housing a 2.0 EIS stabilization. So you get a stable footage with the ability to record in 4K at a very tiny size scale. Now, this year is the very first of its kind, so it's currently on fundraising. So if you guys want your very own, be sure to check out their campaign down below in the description. Now, in this episode here, I'll be unboxing it, seeing exactly what it's about, and giving it a test run. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So this is the box that they sent us. Uh, so this here is the keychain camera shooting at 60 minute recording uh, with a 4K 30 frame per second video with the EIS 2.0 and 5.0 gigahertz Wi-Fi. Uh, so you can go ahead and connect to your phone. It has the capability to shoot at 20 megapixel photos. Uh, it's water resistance, 124 degree field of view, pretty good. Um, and then it's got slow motion capability and a time lapse. So that's actually some nice features. So let's go ahead and open it up. Okay, <laughs> all right, so off the back, you see the camera kind of peeking about. So very small, that's a fact. Oh, nice. So you have this nice looking display. Uh, oh my God, that is a lot smaller than I was imagining. I mean, this thing is really, really tiny. So it's currently on the mount, so I'm gonna just place that right there. So this here is everything that you get. So you have your small camera, surprisingly really small. Um, and then on the front here, you have your camera. You have some LED ring around it so you can use it as a light. Uh, it's got a microphone on the top. And then on the bottom here, you have a little flip uh, that ha houses our USB-C cable port, as well as a micro SD card so you can technically run it off of that too. And then you have your status indicators on the side as well as buttons to go ahead and record. Uh, now you also have a few accessories. So you have a carrying case. So this here is like a rubber housing case to so go ahead and protect it. Mind you, the actual camera itself is made out of a very nice material. The front is almost like a high gloss finish and then the sides are almost like a rubbery compound, which is kind of nice. Um, and then you have this mount. So you can go ahead and mount this onto just about anything um, and then kind of have it showcased as a recording aspect. Now you also have this clip too. So you can go ahead and clip this onto something here just like this and then this will magnetically kind of attach to it just like that uh, and then on top of that we also have another magnetic board so we can go ahead and tape this to the wall and just kind of clip it just like that and lastly we have our USB-C cable which charges our camera now uh, with that being said I think we're just going to go ahead and boot up the app next and try this thing out I'm going to go hold it on uh, it vibrates, so it does have a mortar built into it, so it does vibrate, which is kind of nice, so it kind of gives you feedback. Uh, and the side here kind of indicates blue, yellow, blue, yellow. I'm assuming that means Bluetooth connecting. Uh, so again, it's wireless, uh, and it has an internet Wi-Fi, so it technically it streams a lot smoother that way. So there's two ways to record. Uh, for starters, you have uh, the simple, uh, where you connect it to the app, and then you can record from there. But there's also a quick capture mode, so you simply just take out your camera, uh, and you hold the button to turn it on and you'll see that it'll start flashing yellow and blue. After that, we we'll just go ahead and press the blue button. This will indicate flashes. And from there, it'll start flashing and now we're recording. So if I hold it, it'll go ahead and turn on the light, just like that. Surprisingly, it's actually kind of bright. And then I just go ahead and press it again, just like this, and I'll go ahead and stop recording. All right, I'm gonna go all the way to the app now. And then uh, this app here is called Acaso Go. So I'm gonna go ahead and open that up. Uh, I'm going to click on connect to camera and it's going to tell us to go ahead and find this particular Wi-Fi settings and I'm going to go ahead and go back into the app now and I'm gonna click connect camera and <laughs> look at that. So you can see the live feedback is very nice um, and it's actually got a pretty wide angle lens. Now if I can go in setting modes here and I can go ahead and change the resolution. Uh, so right now we're at 4K 30 frames per second. Uh, you have image stabilization, auto rotate, wind noise reduction, fill light, um, auto shut. So you have all these different variations of different settings that you can go ahead and do. And then if I hit record, now it's currently recording. 
So surprisingly, the quality is actually pretty darn good. And I can also rotate it this way as well. Uh, and then I'll just hit stop and it stop recording. Now from there, I can always go ahead and download it to my actual phone. So we can actually even take photos too, which is nice. So we go into photo mode here, take a nice looking selfie, just like that and hit picture. And then I hit playback. I can go ahead and look at my footage and you can see the quality of it is pretty nice. Uh, so this is shooting at 4K. And then here's the footage of the playback that we're seeing off of it. So it's actually working via Wi-Fi. So surprisingly, the quality is actually pretty darn good. And I can also rotate it this way as well. So you can go ahead and get that nice angle shot based on what you're looking for. So you have all that different functions built right into it. Now, the beauty of this is that you can go ahead and take this wherever you want. You can record wherever you want. And literally, it is one of those things that you can just go ahead and mount onto your backpack and just go out and about. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and run to the other side really quick and see what it looks like in the other room. All right, so we're currently running into our other studio. Uh, you can see in the dark, it's not that good, but in the light, it definitely works out quite well. <laughs> so actually, I'm seeing everything at the same time. This is really cool, especially on my phone right here. So you can see that literally this is what I'm seeing and you can go ahead and rotate it. There you go. So here's my robots. Whoa, look at that. Again, very, very smooth. So like if I'm kind of going up to this go-kart, look at this. <laughs> that is so awesome. Oh. <laughs> All right, well, there you guys have it. So this here is the Acasa Go, definitely a very cool looking piece. And I love the fact that it's so small. I mean, you can go ahead, essentially take this anywhere and use it anywhere, which is amazing. Now, if you guys have any questions, feel free to comment down below. Otherwise, thank you again for watching and we'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye-bye.